It is. It's a mystery machine. <laughs> that is too funny. That is funny. <laughs> On the way to New Orleans to go thrifting. All right. First thrift store. What is this? Is this Tulane? Where's Tulane. this? Tulane. Tulane. All right. This is a great store. We found Everlane here. We found a lot of Bowdoin. So we're excited. Let's see what we find. This is cool. I don't know if it's worth what they're asking for. Because I think they're a kid's size. It's pretty neat. I would buy this, but it's got a stain on it. But these LSU polos do pretty well. Okay, y'all know I like crazy jeans. This says, time is money. I would get these, but I don't want to pay 11 bucks for them. They probably would go for 40 or 50. Okay, this is a good brand, great size. I just don't want to pay $8.99 for it. It's pretty fun. What do you think? Would you buy it? I got a haul this big and like... I know. Okay, so me and Victoria are obviously racking up. Okay, here's what I found for you. A Bowdoin dress. Oh, yay! Okay, but look at the price though. I don't know if you want to pay that. How much is it? A lot. $10.99? I don't know, but I got all this other stuff. That's cute though. Okay. Look, I didn't Ooh. even go through dresses made well. Ooh, very that cute. One, okay, that one's also... This one's an older style made well, but still cute. Oh, it's got a hole. Well, that's a no. Okay, so Victoria's doing pride, ah! a pride uh, booth at one of our pride things. I don't know. This is the New Orleans thing. Um, I got you these Lucky brand, new at tag. Cool. I don't know if you want those or not. Uh, Postmark. Yeah, that's anthropology. Mm -hmm. This one's that's $7 cute. $7 it, that, Cute. See, I found a lot of individually priced stuff. Okay, these were so cool, but I have some, and they aren't moving. But I don't know if you want to try them out. They have the zips at the bottom. Do you I like them? Yeah, they're, they're vintage. Yeah. Dude, oh. like, you're contributing to a problem over here. Lulu's? I don't know if you buy the top. I don't ever buy the tops. All right. And then, I think, is this Lulu's? No, show me your Moo Moo. Oh, show me... Have show, an accident. Show me your Moo Moo. That's cute. And then I still have to go through some of this crap. I haven't gone through Alicia. Dude, I haven't gone through a lot of this store either. I was filming, I was like, what is going on? Look, this is gonna take, I need to hurry it up. I need to, I need to start looking stuff up before I throw it in the buggy is what I need to do. Dude, I have stuff for you, but it's buried. Okay, Sorry. that's okay. <laughs> I've been having fun going through these little bins, like hodgepodge. Do, you never know what you're gonna find. Well, this is definitely the find of the day. We found Tux Blue Balls. Okay, so here's my haul. That'll be a separate video, but here's what I'm gonna put back. This is an Articles of Society denim jacket. Uh, this is an Anthropology. This is Moth. Just not crazy about it, and it has a pool. Um, this is Saks Fifth Avenue. I don't know. I don't really like selling vintage and whatever. I don't really like it anyway. Uh, these are some black Fabletics, but I have so many. These were going to be for me. I have so many. I decided not to get that. Look at this brand. I thought this was a fun cat shirt. Okay, this is Athleta, but it has a lot of spots on it. It has one there, and then they're all over the pocket. If they weren't on the pocket, I probably would get it. It's a 2X, it's a great size. Um, okay, this one I looked up, not really worth much. So gonna leave that one behind. Um, here's some Athleta leggings, but they're all going for like 20 bucks. And they're really, they're really worn. So I'm gonna pass on those. Okay, these are cool. These are like pleather pants. I love the button. But I'm pretty, I didn't know what this was. I'm pretty sure it's just like fast fashion. I saw some other pieces here. That's what it looked like. This is Madewell. It's wool, but it says it's extra large and it's definitely had to have been shrunk. Pass on that one. This is Lulu's. 
just a simple top, passing on that one. And that's something I got for Victoria. Oh, and then I did pass on these. Oh, a lot of this. Look, I gave these to Victoria. Ralph Lauren, she didn't want them either. Uh, these are Citizens of Humanity. These have a kind of like a flare leg, but this is everything she's putting back. Still looking up. What's your these. What's your haul so far? There it is. Okay. Look at my hangers. <laughs> uh, yeah, there's a lot there. This was so cute. This sweater. All right, got it all organized. Here's a sneak peek. All right, I got two bags. Victoria got, oh look, I can take the stupid mask off now. Okay, two bags here. Victoria's got two bags. You look so cute out here. <laughs> Your hair is blowing in the wind. All right, lunch, right? Yes. Let's go. Here's our damage from the first store. We did pretty good. Who else is getting maskiny? Because <laughs> I definitely am. Look at my hair. This is, uh. Humidity. Like, I think it still looks cute. Humidity and maskiny. I'm gonna show you guys how some of these houses look. The pretty trees. We're gonna go eat some Indian. I think it's interesting where the stoplights are in the world. They always have them on the side of the road. On the side. Take it all in, YouTube. Take it all in. All right, Mona's Cafe. Here we are. My mouth is literally watering. So good. Let's dig in. Here's the Starbucks mural. Ooh. Coffee yeah. brunch. <laughs> All right, our fate. One of our favorites, Salvation Army family store on Jefferson. Victoria's coming to get her footage. We've had really good luck here. Wednesday's half off day. That's probably the best day to come, but they always got good stuff here. So let's go check them out. Okay. Look for blue and yellow. I think I'm gonna skip on this one just because it has some holes back here. So, or else I probably would get it. I just looked up this brand ad. It's seven dollars. Comps look really mixed though, so I think I'm gonna pass on this one. So I found Wool Pendleton, but it's monogrammed. So I don't think I'm gonna get it, and I think they want seven bucks. So I'm gonna leave that here. <laughs> yeah, so the store closes pretty soon. I think you should start looking, <laughs> looking through your stuff. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you really went all out on the shoes. There's a, a 360 view, y'all. <laughs> Let's see how much you actually get. This is the before. I'll show the after after. Okay, so they turned most of the lights off on us, but I'm going to show you what I skipped on. So I skipped on these. These are, I found a lot of Fabletics, and I found a crap ton of Lululemon. Y'all just wait to the haul. Uh, but these, I don't know. I'm gonna skip on those. I thought these shorts were cool. They're by a brand I've never heard, Karen Forbes, but everything looked like it was selling for 10 bucks, so I'm not gonna waste my time with that. Prana, I like picking up Prana. I've had my friends donate their pants to me and they sell for like 30 bucks, but comps didn't look good for this one. And I'm still second guessing this. I've bought this before several times. This is an anthropology brand. I don't know. I don't know, I'm gonna still think about it. I also picked up this universal hat, but I don't think it's anything special, so I may pass. That's what she said. <laughs> I didn't get the first part, but. <laughs> well, here's, uh, you can't tell this was your after, uh, but that is her after. It's gonna cost me an arm and a leg. All right, here's the damage. There's just a lot of crap back there, but all I see are money signs. <laughs> and the dude here, he said Lakeview. He said next time we need to go to Lakeview. So we said we're gonna add that one to the list. Let's just stay the night in New Orleans. Yeah, there you go. 
All right, y'all, I'm gonna end the thrift with me. Make sure you're subscribed because I'm gonna have a huge thrift haul with all this crap coming up very soon. See y'all in the next video, bye.